I'm going to show you how to download ringtones into your iPhone using Logic Pro. Uh, the first thing you want to do is um, open up Logic Pro. And go up to File. And you want to click on a new project here. And once your screen comes up, it just says Create. Once there, uh, what you want to do now is um, drag your music into the program. So I have some songs as well as already, I've already made some ringtones in a folder. So I will open up my folder in ringtones here and just find the song uh, that I want to put on there. Let's, let's just try the football since it's, let's see. <laughs> Okay, that's pretty good. So what I'll do is take that particular um, song, drag it over into Logic. And give it a few seconds and it will appear. Then you can close this out here for your, um, where all your uh, songs are. And just take the um, song that you brought in, just slide it over to the very edge to where uh, the playhead begins. And from there, uh, you can play the song back, see how long you want it. So we'll go here and... Okay, and we'll stop it there. And you can trim it down to, to your desired um, length that you want it. I'm going to trim it back down to about here. And then up top, with the little gray bar here, click on it, it'll, turn, it'll highlight yellow. Just drag it out to the length of the uh, ringtone that you want it to be, your desired look, um, length. And from there, you go up to your file, come down to bounce, and come over to project or section. Click on that. You want to change it from an MP3 to an M4A because that's the uh, format for ringtones then you want to bounce it and you want to name it so we will call that let's just name it football and I'll save it to my desktop and bounce it it'll take a few seconds and boom it's already done so we will go to our desktop we will make this a little bit smaller the logic that is and we will come over to our desktop, look for football, and here it is. We can play it from there. All right, we verify that it plays. Now over here, this is important. You want to change where it says football, M4A. You want to click on it once. Uh, then come over here uh, to the very edge after the A, where it says M4A. You want to take the A out. So we'll backspace that out and put in a R. And then uh, hit your enter button, and it will ask you, "Do you want to? Are you sure you want to change it to the M4R?" You say yes. Use that, and that's it. So that from here, we can close out of Logic. We we'll quit Logic. It asks us, "Do we want to change? Save it?" Uh, we can just say, "Don't save it," because we've already gotten it to the hard drive now, to the uh, desktop. So now, from there, we're going to iTunes. And I apologize. I probably should have had all this already open, but at any rate, we'll get there. Okay, from here, we will go into our tones and we will take football and we will drag it in. And once you see the plus sign there, you can let it go. And once that finish loading in here, you come down to your F's, you should see football. And football, 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 down here. There we go. Football is highlighted. So uh, we can click it, make sure it plays. And it's playing. Now we got your ringtone. Now what you want to do is you want to click on your iPhone uh, tab, which is up top. Make sure your iPhone is plugged in. Once you click on that, then go to your tones. And then find football in your tones. And here it is. Put a checkbox in there so it can load. 
once you put the checkbox in click on the checkbox then click on apply and now up top you will see it syncing your iPhone and I'm not gonna let you sit and wait until it syncs but it shouldn't take but a few seconds if that's the only thing that needs to update on your phone uh, but once you're done you click done and your phone is ready with the football on it with the ringtone on football